this morning I was reading in uh, the book of Acts where it says they were um, gathered together fasting and seeking the will of God and then God and they waited like it sounds like some time like not a few minutes but some time until God said separate unto me Paul and Barnabas for to that which I've called them and the Lord just really spoke to me that oftentimes well number one uh, fasting is uh, the only way to separate your will from his will and uh, we often confuse the two <laughs> and uh, second that we don't wait long enough to get the answer we don't wait long enough to get his word I am plead uh, father forgive me because I do that too but and John G. Lake and several other people uh, from decades and centuries ago used to say now that we've asked God for something let's just sit here till we receive it let's just wait until we receive it and and that's a real uh, point too is like ask but wait until you receive something because it's it's a two-way street um, but anyway the main thing I wanted to get out today was that fasting overcomes your own will and it delineates the Lord's will very, very, very clearly for you. Because you have a lot of authority, but if you just start willy-nilly taking authority over stuff and it's not what he told you to do, then it can get you into, you know, I mean, some messes, obviously. So, anyway, fasting, good way to find out what God's will is.